none. There are my audience. Uh, one, two, three, four, and five. Uh, and as we know, Halloween, Halloween is coming soon, and Thanksgiving is coming in the next few weeks. So there will be a bunch of party and like family get together uh, to celebrate it. So today I'm going to uh, teach you guys two recipes and which makes your party will more fancy and more interesting than others. So one recipe is for children and another recipe is for green apps. They are, uh, they are uh, jello shots and uh, uh, orange jello slice. This one is not big done, still need to refrigerate like six hours. And here is a picture for the orange jello slice. And here is another picture for the jello shots that I made last Friday for my parties and my friends love it. Mm -hmm. So that's it. Uh, first, I'm going to introduce what we are going to use for today: uh, orange and the jello powder. Mm, you can use any flavor that you which you want. Well, I'm going to use uh, watermelon for the orange jello, orange jello slice. I'm supposed to use orange powder, but I don't have it. So whatever. This one is uh, you will do for the jello shots. Mm. Here is a spoon and a knife that we are gonna use. The most important, we need to have a cup of boiling water. That's it. First, first of all, we need to cut this orange. Well, I already cut it. And second. You need you need use this spoon to take out the pumps. Mm, yeah. Well, you can use those pumps uh, to make orange juice or whatever you want. Just don't waste it. Um, okay. It should be look like this. It's empty inside. And the next step is to use this boiling, uh, the, a cup of boiling water. You need to put this powder into this. And use this spoon mix it. Mix it. Um, after you mix this, uh, add another a cup of cold water into it. Yeah. That's it. Mix it until it's dissolved. Here we go. And then you need to find a small container for the orange because we, we want to make sure it's uh, stable into it. And put this uh, uh, jello contains into this orange. It should be look like this. And after you've done this, put this in the refrigerator until six hours. After six hours, uh, after six hours, it will be hard. Then it will be hard, and you can cut it. So for the jello shots, well, the only difference is you you should uh, you put the alcohol into the uh, a cup of boiling water instead of water so all you need to do is to have another cup of boiling water and put water in it, into it and mix it after that you put the alcohol into it well the total uh, liquid should be two cups so if you want more alcohol, you put a half cup of boiling water and fill out with alcohol. If you want less alcohol, you can use a cup of boiling water and put a cup of alcohol into it. And after you've done it, uh, just pour out into a small cup and uh, uh, take it to the refrigerator. That's it. It's pretty easy and simple. Uh, let's reveal how to make uh, orange jello slice. So 
first first of all you may want to cut this orange first and after you cut it you need to use a spoon to take out the pumps uh keep um uh, empty peels orange peels after that you will put a uh, jello powder into a cup of boiling water and mix it after that put a cup of cold water into the uh, jello contents and mix them very well and then found a small container to uh, uh, make the orange peel uh, stable and uh, put the jello water into it the last step is to put the uh, or orange jello peel into the refrigerator until six hours so after six hours you can cut it as the uh, as the yellow orange so that's it and you um so look at this uh, uh jello shots you can use it in your Halloween parties your friends gonna love it love you and this orange peel, uh, this orange jello slice can you can use in your Thanksgiving family parties. Uh, the kids can love you, and it will be fun and uh, interesting for your parties. So mm, that's it. And here are my audience. Uh, one, two, three, four, and five. Thank you.